Yeah. These are just protection, but we really don't have to work. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Bye. au revoir. <laughs> Ready? Let's go. River. It's a small river that goes through the, by the uh, by the trail, and it also goes through the campground that we have just at the base of the mountain. It's very nice, and there's a waterfall just after the lake. So it's really when you're around here, you have the view of a little bit of everything with the nature, with the trees, and uh, with the mountain biking. You really have and the hiking. You have access to all that. No motor vehicles that are allowed on the trails except for the patrollers that need that to uh, for the repairs or things like that. But it's really a very nice setting for a day in the outdoors. The shelter is here if you need it, but yes. that's usually not the case. Yeah, usually you don't need it. And you can, like these bikes here we have, we rented them at Spa Expat, so you don't have to bring your bike with you. If you do want to bring your bike, you can. But if you want to travel light, you just rent it at the base of the mountain. You do a day on mountain biking. And these are for cross country. But if you want to do have a little bit of more of a challenge and you want to go downhill, there are some bikes with dual suspensions. So, and uh, you go from the top of the mountain down to the base of the, the bottom of the mountain. It's really something special. You have to want to see the challenge, but it's really nice and uh, people enjoy that very much. And we're gonna go to the top of the mountain in a few minutes, and you're gonna see from there the view you have and the hiking paths you have still at the top as well. The Canyon of St. Anne is where the St. Anne River drops 245 feet over a series of falls and whirlpools as it continues its journey to the St. Lawrence River nearby. Henry David Thoreau walked two days from Quebec City to visit the falls, calling it a wild and rugged and stupendous chasm. The falls can be viewed from above and below from several suspension bridges. So welcome Nancy to Canyon St. Anne, this uh, nice jewel of the Quebec City area uh, tourist industry. Uh, this is just nature here and this is what you will look at today. Uh, it's a nice, nice river going down a very narrow canyon. There's a big waterfall and you can hear it also, it's very nice here. And uh, I work here since uh, three years. and. Uh, you see, it's, it's, it's clearly not a, a work for me. I just enjoy to do it here. And uh, so you will find in this place um, nice rainbows, big rocks all around. Even last year, we had uh, John Travolta and his crew coming to this place for shooting his uh, movie, uh, Battlefield Earth. And uh, we are looking for some more uh, in the future. So this is just beautiful. And uh, I think people, really enjoy when they visit this this place. We have 
of course, uh, visitors from uh, all over the world here. Many Americans, of course and uh, many Europeans and, and people from Japan and Taiwan are also coming to, to this place. And so in the Quebec City area, this is a, just a, a jewel. This is a dandy. Uh, people enjoy it very much. You will find a very nice footpath, very easy footpath, uh, a little bit less than a mile. And uh, you will find three suspended bridges. And one is 180 feet high all over the chasm. It's very, very uh, very nice to do to do it to, to to go across. We have also some services for senior citizens with a shuttle. They can visit it without walking. We have a special also service for uh, handicapped people using wheelchairs. They can go on this uh, suspended bridge here, uh, which is free for these people who can visit a, a magnificent site, uh, which is very rare. They don't they don't do it very often, so they can do it here. It's really nice for those people too. Okay, Nancy, come and join me for a walk on that suspended bridge. Dina, it was great having your company. Did you have fun? Yes, I enjoyed the performances so much. Even though I couldn't understand all the lyrics, it was still great. And the mountain biking at Mount St. Anne, that was wonderful. I love being in the outdoors. Did you hear everybody you wanted to? No, we didn't have time. We'll just have to come back next year. Well, let's do that then. It doesn't matter when you come to Quebec City, Canada. You'll have a good time as we have here at the Summer Festival. Throughout the year, there are special events and shows to enjoy while visiting the historic sites and viewing the beautiful scenery. And for viewers who would like more information, at the end of the credits, we will have an address and telephone number on the screen. We love to hear from you, so please call or write. And be sure to join us again for another edition of Eco News, your best source of current environmental news that affects you and your future. On behalf of our nonprofit organization, Educational Communications, thank you for your support. I'm Nancy Perlman, wishing you a natural, unspoiled environment.